beauties it's your girl claire moy and welcome back to my channel today i am here with a hair tutorial i actually saw this on instagram and i fell in love let me show you what that looks like that's cute right i was like i need it i need it it is so cute so i want to try that today y'all know i love me a cute bob so let's get into that and in the end we are going to compare and see if i nailed it and y'all gotta be honest with me okay don't blow my head up let me know the truth let's get started so the wig that I will be using today to create this bomb hairstyle is by a company called LushWig.com and their packaging comes with some essentials that you can use to apply your wig and some lashes y'all. So this is the new transparent 13 by 6 lace straight wig in 18 inches. This lace is already pre-plugged, so there's not a lot of work you have to do. And on the inside, this lace comes with three combs, two on the side, one in the back, and a adjustable elastic band. I love it. Thank you, babe. Ooh, ooh. Mm -hmm. Good? Yes, what's this? That's um, the mm -hmm. mocha. Mm -hmm. Protein with the um, mm. the Formula One Cafe Latte. Mm. Thank you, babe. You will. And of course, ice. Mm. When I tell you I love these shakes, I don't care. I don't care. Mm. If you're looking for a meal replacement, y'all, that tastes good, that you could actually mess with, click the link in my bio. As you can see, I already applied some got to be glue gel to my forehead <laughs> and then I'm going to place the wig and pull out my sideburns and then tie it with a ponytail. This just really helps my wig stay down and it helps the sideburns really, really stay down. As I mentioned, the lace on this wig is pre-plucked. I don't know why I messed with it. I messed with the lace a little bit, y'all the um the hairline a little bit i did not have to but in the end it still turned out really really well so if you are a beginner you really don't need to mess with this lace or maybe you can like plug a little bit behind the hairline if you want to i blow dried that got to be glue with a blow dryer on cool then i tied the hairline with an elastic band and now i'm just cutting off some of that lace I also washed this wig prior to wearing it because I wanted to make sure that I get the best curl possible. And now I'm just gonna cut a whole bunch of layers into this unit, y'all. I think for this wig, no, not I think, I know that I should have cut this wig shorter in order to look like the, um, in order to get the look that I was going for that I showed you guys in the previous video. From Instagram but I didn't want to cut off too much length but let's just keep watching and then you guys can tell me what you think of the final result okay let's just, just keep watching stick with your girl here I am cutting off the lace y'all and you want to be careful because this lace is transparent it's not HD but it's pretty close to HD so when you are cutting your lace ladies I would advise you to be very careful. All right, so this show, this is proof how transparent this lace is. You have to be very careful because you won't see where your skin begins <laughs> and the lace ends. So, you know, be careful because this lace is very, very transparent. It's not HD lace, but it's very close to HD. So now that the lace is off, I'm going to pull some hair out and begin to plug. Plug away, baby. The plugging went seamless. You just want to plug in whatever direction you go. Don't over plug because you will look like you got bald edges. <laughs> so just, you know, take your time when it comes to plugging. I then went in with my curling iron and I just curled the hair away from my face. 
And the sucky part is I don't have any hairspray, so I wasn't able to use any hairspray, but this hair held the curl the entire day. Now y'all know I take my wig off at night, so I cannot tell you what it was, what it would have been like the next day. I mean, actually it's still curly, just not on my head no more. But without hairspray, this wig kept its curl. But I could tell though, I could tell from the straight texture that it was gonna hold a curl really good because it's not like bone straight. So I'm just clipping these curls up I'm gonna mess with my edges. When I tell you, I still have so much to learn when it comes to edges. And now I am taking out those curls and let's see what we working with, baby. Now I'ma keep it all the way funky. I'ma keep it all the way funkified. This hairstyle did not come out at all like what I wanted it to. I mean, it still really, really came out beautiful. If you guys could leave me some comments in the comment section and let me know what you think I did wrong besides not cutting it short enough. Maybe I should have spent more time combing out the curls with a big tooth comb. I don't know, yeah, but this is what I ended up getting. But baby, it turned out beautiful. Now, let's talk about the new... Okay, so I, I really, really wanted to show you all my lip products that I'm using today because baby whew, these lip products are in collaboration with Dose of Colors and Naima Tang which is the African girl she's really dark skin so she came out with lip products that will show on dark skin like it's the perfect nude for a super super dark skin sister and baby it is gorgeous so she came out with like an orangey color and a brown color, but I like this combination the most for myself. This brown liquid lipstick is actually darker than Chocolate Wasted, and Chocolate Wasted was Dose of Colors darkest shade, but now we have this one. And I'm about to buy some more because it is so beautiful, and it also came in a darker lip liner that will show up on any shade of chocolate. You hear me? But this is the final look, y'all. What do you think? What do you think? I feel sexy. I feel cute. Shout out to Lush, LushWig.com because your hair is really pretty and it held a curl just the way I needed to. Thank you all so much for watching. You know what to do. Subscribe. Turn on those post notifications. Give me a big fat thumbs up, baby. And I will see every single one of you beautiful souls in my next video. Bye.